she found Abby lying on the floor of her room. Say, what kind of people are you, anyway? That swell girl's lying upstairs with her throat burned out with acid. They keep saying she doesn't respond to treatment. Doesn't respond my foot. She doesn't want to live. She got mixed up with a heel. Bob knew he was a heel, but Bob couldn't knock his block off. No, Bob couldn't even go barging into his sister and say, I don't like this guy. He didn't know her well enough. She was only his sister. He was so busy feeling sorry for himself, he didn't have time to think about Abby. People got to work things out for themselves. And you, you didn't know what Phillips was like. For all of you, he might have been Dracula. But his father or one of his folks was in your class, so that makes him okay. Abby's kind of plain. Girls ought to get married. This guy uses the right fork so fine, only don't bother the both of you. Now, look here. You shut up. I've only started. Sure, girls have been crossed up by men before. It's happened to me, but I've always bounced back. But why couldn't Abby roll with it? Cry her eyes out for a while and say, well, that's that. Because he was everything to her. Sun, moon, stars. The friends she never had. The family. Everything. She's been starving and freezing in this Grand Central Station of a house for 18 years. What are you talking about? I'm talking about a little kid that never had any love. Her mother's dead. She hasn't got a father to speak of. Oh, there's a guy named Cap who she sees every couple of years when every place else is closed. She knows he isn't dead because he sends her jewelry. Well, it happens she don't like jewelry and don't wear it even. But you wouldn't know about that or care either. When Philip scrammed, he left her with nothing. When you're in a jam, you got to have a shoulder to cry on and a hand to grab onto. A million bucks hasn't got a shoulder. Oh, sure. Her brother was here. He was here right along. He's drunk, mostly. Bobby, have you been... Yeah, he has and how. But I guess maybe he was lonesome, the same as her. It was Link Phillips for her and the bottle for him. Something hit him about six years back when he came home on Christmas Eve with a big prize under his arm and nobody to show it to. Not even Walpole. What's she talking about? Oh, I guess it's the McBride scholarship I won in my junior year. Oh, yes. Yes, I remember something. You remember something? Huh? Yeah. Him and the second man got stiff that night. The second man sobered up. Master Robert stayed that way. Honest. I thought I'd seen my share of bad fathers and families that had nothing but grief. But compared to this outfit, they were sitting pretty. In my neighborhood, when a man beat his kids, he knew he was beating them, and like as not, the next day he was sorry. For my money, giving them the flat of your hand stacks up pretty good against giving them nothing. And that's what you've given Abby. Nothing. And there she is, upstairs, wanting to die. Because she's got nothing. <laughs> 